consider this system of equations, its original augmented matrix, and the resulting matrices we get when we do Gaussian or Gauss-Jordan elimination. How many solutions does this system of equations have? Well, let's first identify our pivot and pivot columns. What do you notice about the column to the right of the dotted line? It contains a pivot. Therefore, there is no solution that satisfies this initial system of equations. This bottom row represents 0x plus 0y plus 0z equals a non-zero constant. 0x, 0y, and 0z is just 0. 0 added together 3 times is just 0. So for both of these final results, we essentially have 0 equals a non-zero constant. Consider the result we get from Gaussian elimination. Does 0 equal 68? Well, no. For the Gauss-Jordan elimination case, does 0 equal 1? No. Basically, we have something that is not true within our resulting matrices, making it so that no solution exists. We call this an inconsistent matrix.